So the holidays are here and tonight many people will be celebrating the first night of Hanukkah and for the first time the Jewish Festival of Lights is being recognized with a public menorah alighting at the Betsy Ross House. Action News reporter Christy Aletto is live in Old City with more on the beginning of the celebration. Hi Christy. Hey there, Sarah. That's right. That celebration was for anyone and everyone who wanted to attend just across the walkway from the holiday tree is the menorah that was lit for the first night of Hanukkah during a community lighting that happened at sundown. And this wasn't just ceremonial. There were Hanukkah treats, music, and of course, a sense of community. It's the first time ever that at the Betsy Ross House we're going to have a public manure lighting. This is the second year that we've hosted the Old City Holiday Tree and um, somebody suggested this year that if you're going to see the courtyard as more of a community space you should do uh, manure lighting as well. Oh these look delicious. This is a laka. It's a potato, fried potato. Ooh, tradition of Hanukkah. And you're supposed to serve it with applesauce. One of the first public manure lightings ever in the world was here in Philadelphia in 1974, just a few blocks up at Independence. And this is just an extension, Betsy Ross, with the, with the American flag and with everything that historic Philadelphia represents. It's very, very meaningful that people from all backgrounds and all walks of life could actually celebrate their own holiday. And in the last hour, we've seen several people stop by to look at the lights, the holiday tree, and the menorah, which of course is the newest addition here at the Betsy Ross House. It's really nice to see a variety of holiday traditions being celebrated in this one spot.